pain away. I'll do anything. <sighs> Help me. Help me. Give it to me, please. Please. <sighs> Monday, Jennifer. Have a great weekend. And then more cocktails. <laughs> and then cock. Stop. And yeah, then more cocktails. <laughs> oh, look who decided to show up finally. I'm so sorry I'm late. What are you drinking? Oh, do they have milkshakes? You're not drinking a fucking milkshake. It's Friday. Jennifer, I'll get us a bottle. Can I just see the menu? Hi, can I get a bottle of Vermentino? So as I was saying, his name is Brad and he's gorgeous. And he works in finance, can you believe it? Of course he does, Sarah. We're going on a ski trip to Aspen next month. Oh, that's great, I'm so happy for you. And he's got me looking after his dog, Coco Chanel. Isn't she adorable? Is she allowed in here? Damn, Coco. <laughs> well, let's see Brad then. Oh, uh, what do you mean, oh? Do you know him? You know, Jennifer doesn't know men. I mean, he's like really into that dog. Obviously, he loves dogs. He's sensitive like that. You don't like dogs? I just don't trust guys who pose in online dating pictures with their dogs. It shows they're prepared to use sentient beings to get what they want. Oh, he's using the dog as a pussy magnet. Exactly. She's not a sentient. 
She's a Pomeranian. Sarah, she's a Jack Russell. Well, Brad, Coco, and I had a lovely time at the Hamptons. Thank you very much. At least Brad and I did. Coco spent most of it leashed in the yard. If I were to spend a weekend with that guy, I'd be the one on the leash. <laughs> Are you being sexual? It's a bondage thing. You don't worry. So, what's his penis like? Oh. Jesus Christ, Lauren. <laughs> well, <come on. laughs> Well, let's just say, if dogs are really like their owners, then you'd have like a bloodhound or something. <laughs> well, Jennifer, always happy to criticize, but are you dating any guys? Mm, no luck in that department, I'm afraid. Still, surprise, surprise. Like, when was the last time you were even with a guy? I mean, your vagina must be like, sealed up. Sarah, stop. <laughs> I guess I'm just pickier than others. What do you want me to say? Hmm. We're just, you know, trying to give you some friendly advice. Do I need friendly advice? I'm pretty satisfied as I am. We, we just want you to meet someone and be happy. Like me and Brad. Like, why don't you come out with us tonight? You know, meet someone new. I'll be your wing woman. I have work to finish up at home. Oh, forget about work. You were always working. Jennifer, darling, you can't just spend every Friday night sat at home in your old lady pajamas just watching Judge Judy. Well, you gotta live a little. Live a little. Yeah, live a lot. Fine. If you really think my life is so dull and I'm such a frigid loser. Well, we're not saying that, are we not? Well, you've got a lot going on. You just... You, you don't do anything with it. Thank you, Lauren. Fine. I'll go home, get ready, and... Try my best not to disappoint y'all. Jack can pick out your outfit. I mean, what is the point of having a gay roommate if you don't use him? He's not just my roommate, he's my best friend. Well, go get some moral support from him, and we will see you at Medusa's at 10 p.m. Mm. 10 p.m.? A bit past your curfew, is it? <laughs> I'll be there. Yeah, you will. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you girls later. Be good. Jack? Hey, you're back early. What happened to the girls? They're behind on these bills. You need to transfer me that money, Jack. Yeah, don't worry. I'll pay it. Just, uh, not tonight. We're overdue already. I can't cover it by myself this month. I can't. I'm, I'm sorry, okay? I'll, I'll pay it really soon. But until then, I'm gonna carry on providing emotional guidance, which, let's face it, is worth his weight in gold. Yeah. What does guidance weigh, Jack? Can you weigh it? I meant it figuratively? Well, literally, my bank account's running low. And now, I've agreed to go out with the girls tonight. Oh, okay. Where are you going? Medusa's. Clubbing? You? I know. Wow. They taught me into it. Okay, why didn't you say so? I mean, here's some of it. And then you can get the rest when you bring a man home. While I appreciate the gesture, you owe me this money, Jack. Mm -hmm. And you do understand that paying me to bring a man home kind of makes me feel like you're my pimp. It's, it's weird. Oh, I should be your pimp. Yeah, well, don't get your hopes up about me bringing someone back. I'm only going to appease Sarah, Lindsay, and Lauren, and that is it. Well, while you're out pretending to have fun, you know, maybe try to actually enjoy yourself. I'll see if I'm capable. I mean, if there's a hot guy there, and he asks to buy you a drink, just let him. Don't talk about work, for God's sake. Just, just flirt. Why do all my friends think I'm so sexless? Because I've lived with you for six years, Jen, and you've never stayed up later than nine. I have a busy life. Yeah, and a very, very quiet bedroom. Ow, okay. Uh, just, just go, go, go get drunk, go have fun. Come with me. Be my wingman. I can't. I'm having a romantic night in, remember? I mean, he's staying over. Oh, God. I'll get my earplugs out. Shut the fuck up. No, you shut the fuck up. I'll see you later. Have a good night. I'll see you later.
pictures of everything. We need forensics to haul ass. We've got kids in here. Jesus. Go check upstairs. So that must be Dad in the kitchen. So where's the lady of the house? Mm. It was just the three of them. I checked the master bedroom, kids room, bathroom. I don't know what kind of mother could do this to her kids. Maybe it was her stepmother. I don't buy it. Punch you into the abdomen. Looks infected already. It's just like the Mears house murder. Shit. And you know he was missing from the Mears house. The mother. Get, check the kids. Will someone get some goddamn lights on in this place? Power's out. Killer wanted it dark in here. Maybe it was a family pet. Hasn't been fed for a while, smells blood of its owners. That explained the bite marks. Except they just called this in under an hour ago. Neighbors heard screaming. Well, he doesn't look like he'd have been screaming an hour ago. Let's see what we're looking at. 50% loss of blood volume from a single wound. He's drained out. That would take hours. The kids have the exact same marks. A virus? Maybe? Perhaps the two families came into contact. It's just like the goddamn Mears house. Could be the same wacko. Could be multiple people. Could be some kind of cult killing. You know, taking the blood as some kind of token? What? Don't those witchcraft freaks use blood in rituals and stuff? Just doesn't make sense. Hold it! Get a goddamn medic in here now! Hey, um, I'm gonna be a little later tonight. Sorry. Yeah. yeah, work was work's been pretty rough today. Yeah, I'll see you soon, okay? You come down for a drink with the boys, Fred. Uh, look, man, I I can't tonight. That was a rough one for you. You should unwind. Come and have a quick one with us. No, look, I, I got other plans. Is all. You know, they don't bite. Yeah, I know. Plans with a lady friend. She hot? No. Um, look, it's. I'm uh, It's alright, Fred. Always so secretive. We'll get out of you one of these days. I know you. I don't think so. I don't forget a passenger. Especially a passenger who did what you did. What do you think I did? <laughs> well, you and your little girlfriend did a bit of mischief in the back of my cab, honey. Excuse me? Well, maybe I just seen you online. You ever did a porno? you with something officer yeah I'm looking for a guy maybe you can help me he's about five foot eight brown hair brown eyes 
Um, really cute ass. Am I under arrest? No. But I think I'll cuff you anyway. Would you like to dance with us? We're very good dancers. <laughs> Me? Yes. You. Can I bring my friends? <laughs> you both smell really good. <laughs> Just you. We'll look out for you. <laughs> yep. My friends, I take care of you. I'm Isabella. I'm a nurse. I'll get you clean top. Thank you. 
I'm Jennifer. Jennifer. A bottle of still water and two double whiskeys. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I thought we were gonna go clean me up. That's what the water is for. There's plenty of free water in the restroom. I don't do public restrooms. They are filthy. Yeah, I didn't think of that. Not that being filthy, it's always a bad thing. <laughs> Would you like to go somewhere quieter with me? Oh, uh, no, I'm sorry, I'm not, um... There is only so much I can do here. I know a place nearby where I can clean you up properly. Dress that wound. And dress that body. Maybe. This one's for you. secret, Jennifer. The perfect sanctuary for people like you and I. Like what? You will see. Not yet. I'm not sure how they're going to take it. No, they're going to find out at some point. How many months have we been seeing each other now? It's not about how many months. It's just... It's finding the right way to mention it. So it's not because you're unsure about me. Very sure about you. You're too fucking cute not to be. Do you know? Yeah. Okay. Pretty. You want me to? Yeah. Okay.
Are you comfortable, Jennifer? So, hey, hold up. <laughs> Thank you. There you go. All good? All good. Thanks. Hey, Jennifer. You okay? Holy fuck, you look like shit. I didn't want you to see me. What the fuck happened last night? Just don't say anything, okay? All right. <laughs> Grouchy? She'll be all right. She really doesn't drink, so... Are you sure? She seems pretty sick. D don't worry about her. I'll take care of her. You're gonna be late. Shit. I'll see you tomorrow. <sighs> oh, what's that smell? Can you take the trash out? Uh, I took it out this morning. Oh, God, it's making me woozy. I can't smell anything, Jen. Are you still drunk? This water's funny. Probably could've didn't pay the fucking bill. Okay, are you gonna tell me where you've been all night? I can hardly remember. Did you meet a guy? I don't wanna talk about it. What? Oh, you sexy bitch. Was he hot? Just leave me alone, Jack. So that's where you were. Why are you being so weird about it? They think my drink must've been spiked or something. I don't know. What, do you mean like drugged? I, I can't get last night straight in my head. Did someone hurt you? No, 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 it's nothing. I just need to go to bed. My night was fine, thanks for asking. Jennifer? Jen? 
You need to go see a doctor. That looks really bad. No, Jack, it's nothing. It's not nothing, Jen. You got more than a hangover. That looks serious. Look, I woke up this morning in an alleyway. I thought it was just a love bite or something, but it's got worse. It's infected. What did you fuck last night? Frankenstein? It was a girl. I can't even remember her name. Oh my god. I can't remember anything. It's just a blur. Well, she gave you that mark? I don't know. I could have cut myself in the alleyway or something. I don't know. The one time I get some drunken courage to live out my fantasies and this is what I get? Well, you should report her. I said I can't remember anything, Jack. Nothing. Okay, well, you're at least going to see a doctor about that, so get dressed. Time, Fred. Wow. Sleep much last night, buddy? Look, I'm sorry. I, I just got stuck in traffic. But you had time for coffee. Ah, how was she? Huh? You stay at her place. Quiet, please, gentlemen. Okay, Lieutenant. We're recording. You want something to suck on? Absolutely. You'd be pleased to know that the medic you attacked yesterday is recovering well, Mr. Lehman. Where's my wife? We have documents sent to us from a research facility in Romania. Our medical science team informs me that the infection you're suffering from is directly linked to experimental research carried out at this facility. Had this been a leak, our priority is to contain the virus, which would mean that we would require your full compliance in regards to medical testing. Hey, what's he showing him? need your permission to run tests on the bodies of your children. The forensics got a match on the infection. See? Extremely rare virus. Those are test subjects in a Romanian research lab. How did it spread all the way to here? <laughs> Somebody fucked up. Now, Mr. Lehman, I want you to remember back to the incident. Do you recognize the lady in the picture? Is this the lady who attacked your family yesterday afternoon? A war of fun. She was their leader. God damn it, I want an APB out on this woman right away. The gentleman. Fred. Yes, sir. Get those images out to the hospitals and clinics. We'll see if anyone comes in positive for the virus. We need that woman found. These uh, others, uh, were they men, women? Could you describe them in more detail, Mr. Lehman? Frank. Hi, I need this out on the local news, code blue. And this to all medical facilities immediately. Anyone matches, they're to report directly to Lieutenant Peterson. This is why I always wear protection. One minute. Hey, um, sorry, I can't talk right now. Hey, um, I'm sorry to call you at work, but um, something's happened to Jen last night. Um, I think she might have been date raped or something. What? I told her to go to the police, but she won't report it. Would you mind coming by and talking to her later? She's really fucking sick. Like, I've never seen her this bad. Yeah, I mean, she looked pretty terrible this morning. No, no, it's worse than that. She has this rash on her belly, and it's, it's spreading. All done. Does it look like a bite wound? Um, it kinda, it's, it's, so, it's so gross and in, infected. Okay, where are you now? I'm waiting for her to come out of the doctors. Look, Jack, there's some serious virus going around, so just be careful around Jennifer. Don't let her leave that clinic.
Jennifer? Yes. How are we today? Do you think you could close the blinds? It's really bright in here. Oh, sure. Thanks. All right, so what can we do for you today? I have some kind of skin infection, like, like a bite. Like a bug bite? No. Uh, it's hard to explain. And uh, where's the infection located exactly? Around the stomach. Well, shall we take a look? Okay. Can you uh, lift your shirt for me? Mm -hmm. oh, ouch. Are there any other symptoms I should know about? Well, I'm thirsty, but anytime I drink, I just it makes me throw up. Mm -hmm. And I'm cold, like freezing. You do look severely dehydrated. Tell you what, what, can you just wait here a moment? I'm gonna go grab one of my colleagues and he can help me determine the best course of action from here. Why is it serious? Oh, just wait right here, I'll only be a minute. This literally just came in and everywhere is on run alert. Back here. That's really classy, Jennifer. Help me move this. That's oh, too fucking heavy.
stick of shit. Make me fucking sick. Disgusting. Fucking hippie bullshit. What's the matter with you, huh? What the hell? Stink! Absolute fucking stick of state of you, huh? No, don't try and run away. Don't try and hey. fucking run away. Are you afraid? Huh? Should be. Hey, look! Hey! <laughs> Leave the poor guy alone, alright? Who are you waiting for, boy? Uh, sorry? Who are you waiting for? I think this guy's looking for a hookup, right? How much do you charge? Just get lost. I'm waiting for someone. My friend died because of some disease he caught from a blue tiger. Please just leave me alone, okay? No. I'm sick of your kind. Roaming the streets, spreading your diseases like rats. My, my friends are cops, so back the fuck up. Hey, my friend, huh? <laughs> You are like us, one of our kind. You just have to feed, Jennifer. When you feed, it will all go away. You've had a taste. Now you just need more blood. What happened? Jennifer, what the fuck happened? You got into a fight with some guy. Alright, I'll get some ice. Because he told me to. Well, did you call the cops? I couldn't because... Why the hell not? For... <coughs> hey, 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 buddy, hey. It's, it's not her fault. Where did this happen? We went downtown. I thought you were sick. Jack said that you had a serious infection. Did they treat it? It's healing. Ready? Where did you get that, Mark? I, I need to get the two of you to a hospital. Shit. I really gotta take this. Noonan, um, I'm having a bit of a crisis at home. Uh, I'm 
We're just gonna... It's been a double homicide. We need you right away. Fuck. Look, I, I can't... All right, look, I, I could be there in four minutes. Shit! Shit! Look, I, I'm really, really sorry, but I gotta go to work. Um, no. Use my house phone, call for an ambulance. I'll be back as soon Ready. as I can. I'll meet you at the no. hospital, okay? I'm really sorry. Really? Sorry, I came as soon oh. as I could. Don't get too close, Halton. One of them's tested positive for the virus. What happened here? Two dead. One looks like he lost a fight with a grizzly bear, the other's missing pieces of his neck. It's gotta be the same virus. Uh, he's been bitten. The other one's got broken bones, internal bleeding, no teeth marks. My theory is, this virus passes through bites. Oh! Don't touch anything. Sorry. You okay, Fred? Yeah. There's something on your mind, Officer Hall. You guys have any idea who did this? Well, we'll find out. There's no witnesses. Apart from some old homeless guy at the end of the alley. What he's got to say is the end of the world is upon us. Just repeats that. Over and over. Maybe he's right. I gotta make a phone call. He knows something. Like what? Just keep a watch on this other Go back to me if anyone comes within 10 feet of the crime scene. job on those men. You've had your first feet. Very good. What do you want from me? I just want to help Jennifer. mortality can be if only he were eternal like us if only he could be here you did this to him didn't you so he could be one of us perhaps he's already like us victimized and brutalized but with none of the strength that we have to fight with He's dying, Jennifer. I have the power to heal him, like I heal you. I have the bite that can make him like us. Come back to me, Jennifer. Be one of us. Leave as we live. 
feel as we feel. just walked right into our crime scene. Are you sure it's her? 100%. Don't let her leave your sack. We're coming down now. your best friend. Why wouldn't you want him to have what you have? Just make him better. If I do, there is something I want you to do for me. We need new blood. He'll need to feed. You need to feed. With my face all over the news stations, I won't exactly blend in at Medusa. You never did. Hmm. Pick someone from the crowd. Bring them to us. Invite them to our way of life. Think you're up for it, Jen? Do you think you can play the seductor? Hi, this is Officer Fred Halston. Look, can you tell me if a unit was sent out to 2812 Sandy Valley Road? It's a young guy with injuries from a fight. Yes. Are you sure? Shit! Blonde female, early 20s, white dress. Make your way out of 16th Avenue now. I need eyes on her. Officers in the surrounding area, please respond. Jennifer. Lieutenant, 
Lieutenant, I need immediate backup to 16th Avenue. I've got a murder in progress. Positive ID on the killer. I repeat it. Murder in progress. And she's not alone. Fuck! I just need to get inside to speak to my friend. You have a warrant? I'm not on duty. I, I just need to speak with him. Listen, the uniform makes people uncomfortable, sir. This is private property. You need to leave. Shit. Look, man, uh... Can I borrow your shirt and pants? Hell no, motherfucker. Get lost. No, look, uh... I, I can pay you. I know my rights. No, no, seriously, I got, I got like, uh... I, I got, like... Like 50 bucks. You're crazy, man. I'm not gonna help a fucking cop. Hey, I'll take 
Wait, wait, wait! Don't shoot! Look, look, I know him. He's not one of them. Look at his neck, Houghton. It's infected. I got you. Stay with me. Is this how you want to be, Fred? Is this how you want to live? Huh? Like a monster carrying this disease? Be like me. I'm sorry, Fred. This is an abomination. <laughs> Monsters. Our world is doomed for all eternity. Corner 23rd Street, please. What the fuck?
ハハハハ。